Hey everyone and welcome back to Sydney Trains Vlogs. I'm currently at Stanmore Station to not only film some trains for you all as usual, uh, but to uh, give you all a bit of a look at the upgrade to the station. An accessibility upgrade, um, including two brand new lifts, as you can see to the left and right of the screen. A much needed upgrade for Stanmore Station um, giving people in need of lifts um, access, easy access to both platforms. Uh, so we'll head down these lifts, up those, then uh, back down and we'll head back to this platform. Start off with, we've got a plaque here for the Stanmore Station upgrade. Officially opened on the 8th of October 2023 by the Honourable Joe Halen, Minister for Transport. I know I'm a little bit late for this video. But, uh, better late than never. Uh, better late than never. <laughs> Couldn't even say it. <laughs> Sorry, just having a bit of fun. Um, yeah, so let's, uh, let's check out these lifts, shall we? So we'll head down. Kind of cool. Pretty interesting. So head up the lifts, um, lift up to platform number three, which I'll uh, Give me a moment. I tapped off before, now I'll tap back on. Very cool indeed. So now we'll just um, head back over to platforms uh, one and two. Do a little bit of train spotting. The, um, yeah, the transport access program um, is well and truly underway. Uh, it has been for quite a while now. Um, so, at I guess every station in need of lifts will get them. I like the artwork as well as you head into the lifts. Um, pretty cool something different.
just take a walk along the platform here, head up a little bit, see if we're gonna get a couple of trains from the other end, just for a different view. The platform I'm walking along now, uh, platform number one, it doesn't get used. Um, I'm sure in extreme circumstances um, there's a possibility that it could, but um, I've never seen it. As well, when trains pass this platform, you'd probably notice that um, the platform actually sits quite low, or platform one sits quite low. Platform two, not so much. Uh, but yeah, platform one, uh, yeah, there'll be quite a big step, quite a big step from the train to the platform. Um, much like what you'd see at, uh, I think, Deniston, unless I fix that and North Strathfield. You'll see when a train passes this platform. Just, um, just take note of it. I missed a train for that plane. <laughs> um, yeah, no, Stanmore's all right for a bit of plane spotting as well. Sydenham's better. Uh, but just at a complete randomness, if you do want to go plane spotting somewhere, and if you can get there, there's a place called Sheps Mound. So S-H-E-P-S -E Mound. Um, and that's really, it's a pretty good spot. Um, it's sort of like a purpose-made, if that's how you'd say it anyway, um, like a purpose-built sort of park for plane spotting looking over a uh, good part of Sydney Airport. You can definitely get some good photos from there. Um, hopefully a train passes this uh, platform one very soon so you can sort of sort of tell how high up the train sits. You'll be able to see um, the space from the bottom of the doors to um, where the uh, edge of the platform meets the rest of the uh, train's body. Actually, while, uh, while I'm waiting for the next train, one thing I'll uh, mention is another pretty good spot for plane spotting, and you can actually see them fly over quite low as it's like just off the end of um, one of the runways that's in the airport, is the IKEA car park in Tempe. Uh, that place is actually pretty cool. I uh, ended up seeing a US Air Force plane um, among quite a few others landing there a couple of months ago. Um, that might be something I'll do later on, even this is a train channel, but that's alright, it's transport related. Um, might actually head up to, or head over to Tempe one morning. So yeah, have a, have a notice of this.
All right, here's my train, everyone. So that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Please give the video a thumbs up, share the video, all that good stuff, and I'll catch you soon. Ciao.